and slowly open your eyes, look around. Notice, you will notice where the lights came into your room. Listen carefully the songs that you can recognize. Feel your, feel your body and the spirit and the nose and make a deep breath and sense the freshener, the air. Yes, yes, yes. It's a new day. It's the beginning of the day. It's the day where you got to make a new decisions. Take actions. Make new friends and take your life to the beginning of a totally day. Good evening, Toastmasters and friends. My name is Ready. Good evening. Um, Good, evening. Good, evening. Good evening. So, as all you can see, I'm Chinese, and today I'm going to teach you a Chinese word. Hopefully, you can bring it back. So, my topic name is Beginning. Chinese word, Kai Shi. Kai Shi. Kai Shi. Kai Shi. Kai Shi. So uh, <laughs> let's start from the reason why I joined to Toastmaster. Nora the one recommended me here uh, as a guest. And uh, I came here as a guest and I saw all the environment and made me suddenly remember the first time I had English contest when I was at university. Uh, as all you can see, I'm not a very talkative person, <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, but why I didn't participate in a huge of English contest, by the way, there was more than 3,000 students in that contest. The only reason is because of the guy who <coughs> is organizer, I really like him, <laughs> and then he told me, he's the one recommended me to be on that English contest. He the one told me, really don't be nervous, I teach you a secret. The secret is when you look at all around the people, just acting their head at cabbage. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like you know, it's like you're talking to yourself. <laughs> so after that, I moved to Dubai and um, before Business Excellence Department, I worked as a receptionist and uh, uh, I was so, the first day when I started, I was so confident, stand there and uh, a bit nervous. I scared, you know, there are people if ask me some professional things, word, I can't understand. So I was standing there, have very happy, greet everyone, and there was a British couple walking to me, and uh, they were asking, excuse me, madam, uh, may I ask where is that tall lady with a British accent? And I answered straight away, wow, this is a very simple question. <laughs> and uh, I answered straight away, Madam, which uh, tall lady are you looking for? A colleague or guest? <laughs> and the gentleman was next to her and stood, stand, stood next to her. And uh, he showed his emotion, like very surprised. And uh, asking, uh, Madam, do you know my wife is asking where is the tall Toilet. Where I <laughs> Not toilet. <laughs> wow, that's made me so embarrassed. And uh, can you imagine my face become totally bright? <laughs> this situation, this embarrass, I feel I, I will never forget. This is just the beginning of my career. So uh, and, uh, let's move to my personal life. And uh, my personal life, uh, beginning, first time. I don't know what will come to your mind. Something come to my mind first is a bit of love. So uh, make me remember my first time meet my husband. Uh, I met my I met my husband when I when, when we had a friends party. He was the one sitting in the corner, and the most of friends they know me. They know my name is Rin. So when turned to me, of course we started introduce myself. So when turns to me. And uh, I just introduced myself normally. My name is Rini, and I'm Chinese. And then he showed his emotion very, very. He showed Rini. Is it Rini like this? <laughs> and uh, everyone was laughing. And that made me feel 
uh, I know him because he was the one you know uh, laugh at me. Even later on, I was uh, joke with him. I said, you know, if you are not showing too much reaction of my name, I won't know you. Because why? Laugh handsome guy. You are not. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, even he's not handsome, but he's very supporting me, supporting me everything on my hobby, on everything special on my hobby. So my hobby, uh, I can see it's a loss. When I started, like uh, oh, that time, Owen Dubai started very popular with diving. He paid the course. Uh, he paid my course uh, the diving fee, and. Uh, he said, darling, I believe you will complete because one of my friends was diving master. I feel that is a really good job. If one day I lose my job, I will become diving master. He said, okay, darling, go, no problem. And then when I went there, and I feel, uh, I feel as scared when I swim in the shadows. I, I said, I found this and that excuse. I said, okay, no problem. Next day, and uh, when I start my pastry, I, I, when I went to visit friends, and started pastry, and uh, I said I love the, the food, and uh, he said okay I will buy this and that. So my husband always supported me. So when I came to Toastmaster, I asked him can you recommend me what is my hobby? He said just uh, tell all the Toastmasters your hobby is a loss but it never complete. <laughs> so this time I'm here in Toastmaster. They told me, please tell all the Toastmasters, look after you, make sure you will have uh, first, second, third, fourth, all the stage, and uh, grow up with everyone, with all of you. Thank you.